guys, we are back with another video. And today I'll be showing you how to make your own camping game part two. Part three, I mean, we want you to join our army. How did Donald Trump join Roblox? Want me to show you that, Ed? We want you to join the army. Donald Trump paid Roblox to get premium. That's just weird. Donald J. Trump. Donald J. Trump joined the army. Vote Trump! 2020, keep America great, keep America fun. So first thing you're gonna wanna do, click on the house and duplicate it by pressing Control D. Come over here to this new house. Then you're gonna get the noob and move him over in the house. Then you're gonna come in here. Then you're gonna wanna search in the toolbox. Tell. 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 Poor teleporters. One second, guys. I gotta use the bathroom. Be right back. Oh my god, I gotta use the bathroom. Second, you guys. I'm back, had to, you know, do my business. Then, select these teleporters. Select this one. Then move this one over here into the house with noob or whatever your character is and then you're gonna come over here select this one move it up here And now, can you play your game? <laughs> Recording a YouTube video. So, then walk down your road. Do this. Welcome to Dupe's house. Okay, just play your game. Go upstairs. It should... Well, that's a 
bug, 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 bug alert, noob house is bugged, bug alert, maybe if we shrink this, it will work. That's way too small. Maybe like that big. Now it should work. Let me test it. Remember that shop we made yesterday, how you can buy all these cool gamer items? Welcome to Noob's house, okay? Noob is mad at something, go inside. Oh, we don't need to talk to Mama Noob. Why did not TP me? Okay, there we go. Buckle alert. Bugle alert. Bugle alert. Just delete that model. Use a different one. O and H. I love O and H. O and H are one of my favorite letters, if you believe it or not. Okay, these are kind of crappy. So then what you're gonna do is click on the mama noob. That's completely dumb because I made her dumb. Or whatever you made her. Made her, 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 Noob is... Out, O U T S outside. So then the player is gonna actually move Mama Noob, Mama Noob, Mama Noob, Mama Noob, Mama Noob, Mama Noob, Mama Noob. Move Mama Noob right here, and then select the. In the back yard. Man. Mama Noob's wig is causing some trouble. We'll go in the back yard, back yard, back yard, back y journal. Only boys pee in there. <laughs> Hold on. I need to place it like right there with Mama Noob's Mama. Mama. Noob just comes running outside and says, Mama. My mom and dad are um, away because I have this friend. They subbed to me like a couple videos ago. I gave a shout out to them. And um, they're, no, it's, it, it's a coincidence that they're, that me and my friend's parents had the um same exact birthday date. It was weird that we met in kindergarten too. We met in preschool. Yeah. Strange UI text label. Gotta move this, move this, move, move this. I can sub the ship. Is this going to annoy the players? Hold on. I don't think so. That 
then grab the one that says that just says teleporters should be the one over here right here look where my mouse is this one this is the one i use for bacon the killer but things that teleport you to the match Bacon the Killer is very old school because there was no scripting. Like, I just got in the mood of free models. I know that might change Zorgo's emotions about Bacon Killer, but sorry. These are also the same things I used in um, the... Uh, Daycare 2 I made before the actual Daycare 2 I made. Took my idea. Got popular. But it was a rip of Got popular. Then anyways, test your game. Once you've got the teleporter set up, just rewind. Go do what I did. They can even turn the lights off. It's just getting too right. Then it will teleport you to the next house. See? I was back there and it teleported me over here. <laughs> then move noob. Noob, I'm sorry I have to move noob. Move noob, move noob, move noob. Move noob. And right there. Search in the models. Fence. Actually, let's do it the fancy way. I'm gonna select a part. Make it at the edge. And extend it. Like this. Set the transparency to 1. Then you're gonna get a... Then you're gonna go to images. Search fence then a bunch of these images you're gonna want to choose well this one because it suits the backyard mood and also shrink down the part a bit so it's more realistic and then you're gonna want to place a part Actually, let me reset that. Move the teleporter for here. Up. Make sure you're doing this at the second house. Not the one back there. Make sure you're doing it at this house, not that house. Make it like this. Then change the color to green. Then change it to grass. So it's like this. Then if the noob's a bit in the ground, just move him up a bit. Then move the teleporter, which should be teleporter 2, and unless you use teleporter 1 for this, down. And set the color of it to green. Then set it to of this foresty green. I want the second one to be foresty green. Then with this one, you're gonna <laughs> do the same thing as the grass, basically. But don't duplicate it. Just gonna you know, do this. Make it like this, you know, then make it shrink it down a bit. So it looks usual. So then play our game. 
then go over here. Road. Down the road. Talk to Mama Noob. Just play your game. You could play your game. And go out here. It should teleport you to the yard with Noob in it. Why are you here? Your house part. Part? I talked about that last video. Oh. I'll be down there in a min. And change that to... To... To come here, come here. Now, if you test your game, go out to the backyard. Why are you here? Your house party! Come here! And then you're gonna wanna change it to come here, go in the cave. Then over here, you're gonna wanna select this brick, the fence brick, and duplicate it. A little bit over here. Sorry, I burped. I burped a lot yes in yesterday's video. Sorry about that, guys. I make it the same thing as this one. Also, place a brick right here. Change the texture of it to grass. Looks like, so it looks like that. And then over here, you're going to want to search in the th thing, not images, models, but cave. Then select any cave. Like, I'm just going to go with a cave. With a model called a cave. A cave on the toolbox, but like, like first floor cave in the thingy. <sighs> Got a drink. Got to drink it. <sighs> what? Oh, what? Oh, what? Oh, what? Oh, what? Oh, what? Okay, maybe don't use the same model as me. Let me anchor this. You can use it as long as you anchor it or else that's going to happen. But if you think it's funny, then you can keep it. Plus, I don't accept, I don't think this game that you made is going to get very big. Because... Well, reasons, because, um, it's pretty basic and stuff. And I forgot back here, you're going to have a part, place it down. You're going to want to move it over here. At this door, the backyard door. House 2, the same thing. Where you did the, um, normal stuff. So then you cannot get back into Noob's house. You have to go this way into the cave. And you're gonna select... A wall torch, whichever wall torch your heart desires, like I found my wall torch. I'm gonna place it right here.
actually just delete it. Get this as a sign. Right here. This. Then you're gonna have back here. We're gonna have this part be can collide false so then they can walk through it and get the secret ending but we'll be on to that soon. Let me just real quickly delete this. You're gonna get a new image. Search B where. That image is nothing. Just get whatever beware image comes to your heart desired. And I'm also gonna change the color of this to red so it matches. And in the cave, we're gonna click on your teleporter and then copy and paste them. I mean, um, duplicate them. Then select the teleporter to move it over here. The teleporter to a book copy. And where's teleporter one? Move teleporter one over here where the rest of the cave is going to be. So when you play your game, you should be able to walk over here. Hey, I got mama noobs here on right. Come over here and we'll teleport you. Beware. We'll walk through the cave, then it will teleport you to the rest of the cave. So then you're gonna say goodbye to your little house area. And I'm gonna start working on the cave you're gonna click on this set select teleporter two or one whichever you want set the transparency to one make it small so we don't teleport back so it's like this then you're gonna wanna select that, the gray one, gray, gray, gray. Then set the texture of it to, what texture is the cave? Silver flip flop. In what's the texture of it? It's stale. So then you're gonna spawn in your part. Set the texture of it to 
stale. Like the other part. And you're gonna make it that. And you're gonna come over here, copy the thing. I know it might look invisible on this side, but trust me, it's a fence fence. Because images are problems. If that's an image problem. But if you wanted to make it more realistic, you can place an image on b the same image on both sides by simply just finding the image again and placing it on the other side. But if you don't want to do that, you can leave it. I'm actually going to... Um, so, search, um, fog in here. I'm actually going to make it just place a part down like this. Change the thing, change the mar marble or whatever to stale, then size it. like that then over here so now the player cannot walk through the part let me show you why they can't walk through it be clear walk through the cave now if they walk through it, they cannot get through it completely. There is a part. Set this part to anchor in case someone hacks and gets a bazooka and shoots it down. That won't happen when you anchor it. Plus, I don't expect someone to hack on your game. Unless Moby from some of Greatcraft's streams join. Make it like, s place a part down and make it slanted. So then, that will give it like a more cavey effect. You're also gonna move the teleporter. Where is it? Over here a bit. Then you're gonna select this part, make it right there, change it to stale, and then make it like this. And then you're gonna extend it so it's like this. Then up here, <laughs> remember how I made you search for fog? We're gonna get this fog and place it down right there. So then. Test your game. I'm just drinking. Then there should be realistic thought. Maybe just delete these two platforms delete the fog too and make just a normal roof please just make it right there so 
set it to steel. Move it over. Make it like that. Move it across like that. Go under here. And click this. Change it to stale. Move it up here. Then you're going to place it down. Then you're going to make it like this. Then you're going to get your model ever you wanted um this tutorial if you this is the end of the tutorial season like yeah right now i plug in build a rag we're gonna make a rattle, a model, not a rattle. Why? Well, I don't. Okay, that that's weird. Why is that equipped? Just build your rag, customize it, do whatever, then select the head, plus a image label, I mean a decal, a, 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 a dialogue, <gasps> my god, then make it where, ha, 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 and make it, oh, no. Make the goodbye thing, oh no. Then you're gonna select the choice dialog. Then make a user dialog say, I don't care about. this house p a r t y i don't care about this house party and then noobkin's response dialogue and then what noob's gonna say is Let me just test our game. Why I said R is because you guys are making it, unless you're one of those people who just listen to the tutorials and don't do them. This epic gamer shop we made last time was epic! We're gonna enter a number choice dialogue and make the user dialogue. No, and make it the user dialogue. Why <laughs> make it?
user. What should I make it? User, um, dialogue. Hey, 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 noob. Ha <laughs> ha. No response dialogue. Hey. Past O U T Then you're gonna name him. Name him Hook. Name him Nope, nothing. I was don't name him Hook. Hook 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 Then let's get back to that secret ending I told you guys about. We're gonna select this make a part right here. Near your grass thing that you put down. Or, like, maybe, like, I made you put it down. And duplicate it. Make it right here. Move it halfway slightly in the house. Spawn another part. Go like this. Make it up. Make it taller. Select this. Set the shadow cast off. Click on this. Just set the shadow cast off for all of these. Then move this. Like. Oof. Slightly. Ooh, move this slightly in the house some more. Make it move in the thing some more. Get a roof. Scroll down into it. Click on the roof. Set the shadow cast off. Then spawn in a rag. Go into plugins, spawn in a build rag. Tell me if this video gets free likes, the tutorial will continue. Let me just customize my rag.
guys and i'm just gonna finish this off this is the final part final part final part just finish writing your text response dialogue um i'm gonna get Friend changes face to devil. Devil, right? Devil face. That's our game. Hope you enjoyed this amazing tutorial. You can publish your game, do whatever you want with it. Next video is going to be a part one of another tutorial. Bye.